Queen Chrysalis. Your chaos has helped me break free. And now, Krillict will return. It was just a dream. Oh no, Diamond Rose. It's not just a dream. But then I was like, oh no, the party's all just a dream. And then that alicorn pony was there and I just woke up. And scared me half to death with your screaming. Yeah, sorry about that. <sighs> it's fine. But I can assure you that party event, it wasn't a dream. Although it did feel like a creepy nightmare. But it just all freaks me out. Like, how did that alicorn pony know who I was? I don't know. Are you sure you don't recognize her? Uh, if I knew a pony like that, I would definitely remember her. Okay, okay, but I don't think you have to worry about it. After she mentioned your name, you just sort of fainted, and then she disappeared. She's just probably one of Celestia's creepy cousins who she seriously hates. Think about it. They're both alicorns, and they hate each other. Rarity. I do appreciate you trying to comfort me, but I seriously doubt that pony was any cousin of Celestia. Yes, I suppose you're right. She didn't really look like a princess anyway. Ugh, I don't know what to do! Come in! Um, hi. Oh, hi Sunset Shimmer. Uh, come in. Uh, really? I've never been in Sweetie Swirl's room before. Yes, well, this isn't her room anymore. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Uh, Diamond Rose, are you ready to move into Cadient? Oh, I totally forgot about that. What? You're leaving already? But we, we were starting to become good friends. We still can be. Yes, but if you're a Cadient, I won't be able to talk to you. Oh. I forgot. That's just how the school works, Diamond Rose. We like to keep to our own houses. Right! Um, Cass. Meow. Meow, 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 meow. Whee! Meow, meow, meow. Right. So long, fellow sleeping bag. Uh, the memories. Ahem. <clears throat> hey, Rarity. Oh. What do you girls want? Uh, um, we just wanted to say... Sorry. I yeah, sorry for like, treating you bad and stuff and like, following Sweetie's orders when actually she's really mean and stuff. Oh, well, I forgive you. <gasps> oh, really? Oh, and um, we were wondering if we could be like, Friends again? <sighs> Alright, but we're running things a little differently, okay? Yeah, right, we'll, we'll be we'll be super close and bestest friends. Um, you can't be my best friend though. What? But, but why? Because I've already got a best friend. What? Who? <gasps> Sunset Shimmer. <sighs> what? Uh, 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 me? Yes, you! She actually stood up for me when I was being bullied by Sweetie. And we're best gal pals. But she's the loner. 
uh, not anymore. And if you have an issue with it, you don't have to sit with me at the lunch table. Well, I'm totally cool with it. I love making new friends. Mmm, that's great, Lemony Gem. Snow? Uh, all right, I guess. <gasps> that's great. I'll see you girls at lunch. <laughs> see you, Rarity. Yeah, I'll see you girls. And I can't wait to get to know you, Sunset Shimmer. You seem really cool. Although, I was afraid to say it in front of Sweetie. And I'm sorry for that. I hope we get to be good friends! Lemony Jam! What just happened? It's okay, Sunset. Is this gonna be like a joke to you? Like what Sweetie did with me long ago? No, Sunset, I haven't forgotten when you helped me. At the party. And I'm thankful for that. You're actually a really cool pony, and I want to get to know you. If you're willing to get to know me. The real me, that is. Yeah, but I'm not used to friends. Hey, I thought we were friends. Uh, I didn't think we were. What? Well, become both of our friends. Yeah. Uh, uh. Come on, Sunset. Friendship isn't that scary. Uh, fine. But not too much girly talk, okay? And when I say girly, I mean sweetie. <laughs> Don't worry, the old me that's been brainwashed by Sweetie is long gone. And I just really want to be your friend. <laughs> okay then, we're friends. <gasps> Yay! So, what are you doing? Uh, it's called a hug. <laughs> okay, I knew that. <sighs> Diamond Rose, you gotta be quick. Princess Cadence and Luna are waiting for you. <sighs> oh shoot, <sighs> see you guys. Meow. <laughs> You ready to leave? <laughs> ready as I'll ever be. Aha, uh -huh, Diamond Rose. I'm so sorry I'm late, Princess Luna. I just got a bit muddled with my packing. Oh, it's okay, Diamond Rose. You're here now. Um, thank you, Princess Cadence. <laughs> it's okay, sweetie. Um, actually, I was wondering if I could ask Diamond Rose, I would like to speak with you before you leave our house. Oh, uh, of course. Oh, um, I'll give you a moment. Um, is this about what happened at the party? I, I don't know what happened. I, I swear I don't know that alicorn. It is fine. Me and the other princesses have arranged a time for us to speak of this. You will be having a meeting with us after you've settled in Cadient, so you will be missing a few of your lessons. Oh, right. Because I've been worrying all morning and... Then what is it you want to talk to me about? Well, I have been observing you while you've been in House Lulamoon. And of course, the type of ponies you've been hanging out with. Right. Before I asked you if you were ready to move into Lulamoon, you responded unsure. Yet now if I was to tell you you were a Lulamoon, how would you feel of that? I would feel honoured. And why is it, do you think, you changed your mind after spending time in House Lulamoon? Um... I guess it's because I actually experienced what it's like to be in Lulamoon. Before being in Lulamoon, I just saw the outside of it, and it was scary. But then when I became a Lulamoon myself, I was able to see all these different ponies in a different way, and know them for the true ponies they are. And throughout that, I suppose I achieved in making friends, and achieved in what I set out to do, which was to not give up. And I didn't. Now that, Diamond Rose, is the true words of a Lulamoon. What? Are you saying there's a good chance I'm a Lulamoon? But I'm nothing like the ponies here. They're just so amazing. They're so ambitious, and they achieve anything they set their heart on. I didn't do any of that. In potions, I totally failed. And then I became a meanie. Lulamoons are ambitious, and when they set their heart on something, they do achieve it no matter what. Exactly! Which is precisely why I see Lulamoon in you, Diamond Rose. You set out to get through Lulamoon and see it for what it really is, and you achieved that. You have a lot of determination, Diamond Rose, and I see something special in you. Something that's different. And who says there's anything wrong with being different?
Uh, are we ready? Yes. We will be meeting 11 a.m. in Princess Celestia's office. Right. I'll take her with me. You have nothing to worry about. Okay. Good luck, Diamond Rose. And just remember what you're setting out to do. And achieve it. Let's go. Bye, Diamond Rose. See ya. Have fun in Cadian. But not too much so you end up in Lula Moon. <laughs> See you guys.